Jace for here today with a tutorial on a cool looking barbecue with a hinged lid complete with grills. The first thing you're going to need to build your grill, you're going to need three of these two by three plates. Set them side by side. And we're going to start building the bottom of our grill. Take a 2x6 plate. We'll place it right here. We got this one stud recessed opening here. The next thing you're going to need to use is two of these 1x1 one one studs or plates. Place them here on the sides. Start forming the sides of our grill. Next, we're going to take a 1x6 plate, place it here at the front. This will be the front of our grill. Now, simply take two of these 1x2 plates, we'll place them one on each side here. And there we have it, there's the body of our grill. Now I want to put an opening lid on the top of this. So I'm just going to take two of these hinge type style plate bricks things, <clears throat> place them here inside the this stud thing. And that's why I left this part here open so the um, hinge here doesn't hit the studs. We're simply just going to place these two in here side by side. Then take six of these black grates. You can place them any way you want. I'm going to place them vertically. Side by side. And this will be the grill of our barbecue. There you have it. There's the body of our grill. Okay, we'll just set this aside here. Now we're going to make the lid to our barbecue. I want to take a 1x6 plate. I'm going to take two light gray 1x1 plates. We're going to place them on either end here. This is going to be the spot we'll attach our hinge. So simply take this. We're going to place our hinges right in this spot here. And that's going to be where our, how we attach our lid. Take a 1x6 brick. Place it here at the back, just like that. A 1x6 plate. We'll place it on the top here. And since I got a gray since I had to use gray here, I didn't have any light gray or dark gray, so I used light gray here. I'm just going to take a light gray 1x6 plate, stack it on here, just to keep things balanced. And finally, I'm just going to take three of these 1x2 30, 30 degree slope, uh, sloping bricks. I'll place them here along the front. This will be the front of our lid. There you have it. There's a there's the working lid for our barbecue. See it closes nice and it's flush. Now let's get started on the wheels. The first thing we're going to start off with is a wheel assembly. If I can get the uh, piece here. Looks like something you'd find like, I don't know, probably for a miniature train. And a little small little wheel and axle. Stick this on the bottom here. This is going to be the wheels for a barbecue. Now, this is an odd number and I, can't, I wish I could just stick this on here like this. I cannot. So I'm going to take four of these 
or two or two of these two by two or one by two jumpers. Place them on our wheel. where the studs line up with the wheels. Now I can simply just come in, place it right here, and there's the wheels to our barbecuer. I already have another one made up, so we just simply just come in and place it on the other side. There you have it, a complete barbecue grill for a Lego house, <clears throat> a school, maybe um, maybe if you're making a camping set. And the beauty of this grill is, is I can put a full-size Lego turkey on there. If you want to roast a Thanksgiving dinner or something like that. There you have it. My Lego barbecue grill. Thank you for watching.